this is game based caselet and looks like looks like a di caselet or di questions but after understanding the question you will feel it is just another expression of integral solutions but how to approach and how to analyze this type of question very easily without doing mistake just i want to discuss question is not tough just introductory level question is telling india australia sri lanka new zealand and pakistan are in group a of world cup 2024 each team plays one match with other winning will get two points loss will get zero and draw will get one each question is asking minimum points to qualify for semi final from group a and maximum points to disqualify for semi final from group a means out of these five teams to qualify for semi final means top two team who are performing best they will qualify for semi final or your performance parameter is how many points you are getting top two team who are getting maximum points they will qualify for semi final then what is the minimum point any team can qualify for semi final and what is the maximum point any team got but he will disqualify for semi final typical question just will try to understand in different way and afterwards you will understand this is just another representation of last questions whatever i discussed a plus b plus c plus d plus c equal to 20 Five teams total match five C two ten matches total points twenty because win and loss two points will distribute and draw and draw happening then also two points one point each team then total points equal to twenty this twenty we have to distribute to the five teams only thing is there last question condition was not that much a strict we can go for some other value freedom was there but now condition is very strict what is a strict this this team cannot go beyond 8 any of the teams any of the teams here cannot go beyond 8 because out of five teams any team will play four matches maximum he can get 8 points only if all the four matches he is winning and this is the condition if one team is getting 8 points then next team cannot get more than 6 next team cannot get more than 4 next team cannot get more than 2 and next team cannot get more than 0 this is ideal distribution we can just two we can take out 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 0 we can write in this way also four matches three matches two matches one matches and zero matches this is number of winning this is four win three win two win one win zero win the last team has lost against all the team remaining four team how to find the minimum points to qualify what to do generally we are getting this idea how to how to do it but we will get confusion from where distribution we should start we must start from top to bottom then only you will not do mistake and if this question will make further complicated also i will do the complication just to wait another 1 minute it is going to become much interesting you must do from top to bottom if you want to find minimum what you have to do top team you give maximum points top team you give maximum points remaining how many teams are there you divide equally game is over but always from top to bottom top team can get maximum 8 points remaining points are 12 four team can distribute 3 point each what will happen who are getting 3 points he will qualify because second team is there second team is there third team also 3 fourth team also 3 out of these four teams any one team will qualify for semi final based on the run rate or based on the some other criteria duckworth lewis whatever will be there but all team are having same points then any one will go for semi final any one this is the minimum point to qualify for semi final if you want to find the maximum then what to do you must proceed from bottom to top number distribution you do from bottom to top if here you will do from top to bottom then you will get confusion and you will do the mistake but if you are doing from bottom to top any of the condition you will not do mistake what you have to do lower uh, bottom most team it is zero second team you don't give zero don't give one don't give two don't give don't give three or four these two teams will play how many match between each other only one match how many points two points for one match like this team and this team will play one match against each other two points must be shared between these two teams minimum means here you can't make fourth team also zero this year mistake or we can say what's the distribution we can make one also no 
लास्ट टीम जीरो सेकेंड लास्ट टीम मिनिमम टू मिनिमम टू दिस मिनिमम टू वाई वी आर गिविंग मिनिमम बिकॉज वी हैव टू मैक्सिमाइज अदर थ्री टीम देन दिस रिमेनिंग थ्री टीम यू पुट रिमेनिंग पॉइंट एटीन सिक्स 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 वॉट विल हैपन वन विल क्वालिफाई वन विल बी आउट Although this guy, this team is getting six point exactly equal to this team, but this will be rejected. This will be selected because anyone has to go for semi final. Anyone has to go for semi final. Then this we this is the maximum point for rejection. Means any team will get six point. Still they will not qualify for semi final. And another scenario, one team will get three points and he will qualify for semi final. Now we'll just make little twisting to make further interesting. Now I'm extending the idea to third question based on this data. What can be the maximum difference between winner and qualify for semi-final? Maximum difference between winner of the tournament and qualifier for semi-final. Who will be winner? First criteria: he should qualify from group to semi-final, group to semi-final, and from semi-final to final. means after group he has to play two matches one is semi final one is final who will win semi final final both they will become winner he will become winner then what can be the maximum difference between winner and qualifier for semi final what can be maximum difference second next question is what can be the minimum difference between winner and qualifier for the semi final and next question little bit more interesting what can be the minimum difference between winner and runner up what can be minimum difference between winner and runner up just suppose maximum difference when it will come between winner and qualifier it will arise when winning who is winning he will get maximum point he is the throughout topper in group also he has performed the best he got all the all the match he he, he has win and after our semi final he has win and final also win means he will get maximum and who are qualifying for the semi final he got minimum that will give you the maximum difference just will try to understand in this way maximum difference means maximum for winner and minimum for qualifier maximum for winner can be 8 plus 2 plus 2 this is for group this is for semi final this is for final then only he will become winner no alternative then 8 plus 2 plus 2 it will become 12 12 minus 3 it will be 9 this can be the maximum difference between winner and qualifier for qualifier minimum point is 3 to qualify for semi final to qualify for semi final semi final qualifier now next is minimum difference then winner is getting minimum points and who are qualifying he is getting maximum points okay like just qualifier minimum any person who can qualify for semi final that is 3 points that is from group this is your semi final and this is your final okay this is your final then 3 plus 2 plus 2 how much you are getting 7 maximum point who are qualifying it will become 6 then we can get 1 for qualifying minimum winner and runner up minimum difference between winner and runner up one of the team can win if he is qualifying with the 3 points means 3 plus 2 plus 2 and another person can lose and become runner up once he will just lose the match in final means semi final he will win and uh, group also he has done uh, done very wonderful means 8 plus 2 then 3 plus 2 plus 2 it will become 7 minus 10 minus 3 this can be the means one of the person who got 10 points but he will be runner up and another person who got 7 points and he will lift the trophy these all thing will happen i think uh, if you will just try to read about the 1992 cricket world cup because many of the people are interested in cricket world cup then just you read the story how pakistan has won the cricket world cup of 1992 you will become surprised not a single match he has been in group group level due to some average points and some uh, raining condition he has qualified for quarter final and afterwards only he has done he has win three continuous match quarter final semi final and final and lift